if you wanted to deflect an asteroid, a simple way is uh, to send a spacecraft to actually hit the asteroid. It's like, uh, you know, I call it a cosmic car accident. This is exactly what NASA did, where they demonstrated that this can be done. There are always asteroids falling down on our planet. There was one just a week ago where meteorites were found in the field. The Chelyabinsk event, which was a 20 meter object, it occurred about 10 years ago. And something like that could happen typically every hundred, maybe a few hundred years. It damaged a lot. I mean, there were 1,500 injured people. Asteroid exploration is important both for science sake, these are the leftovers of the formation of the solar system, but also if we ever found an asteroid that posed an impact threat to Earth, we would want to know as much about it as possible, both for science sake and for planetary defense. We are setting up systems that inform us that something could happen. We're setting up contacts to emergency response agencies. It's a bit like earthquakes, only we can actually predict the event very well. There are currently two places on this planet where risk predictions are done, uh, one in Europe, one in the US, and both of them predict impact probabilities 100 years into the future. Asteroid Apophis will come really close in the year 2029. It will be inside the geostationary belt of satellites where we have all these telecommunication satellites, weather satellites. There's nothing to be worried about. It's a large object, almost 400 meters in size, but we know that it will fly by uh, at about 30,000 kilometers to the Earth within just a few kilometers. So it will not hit the Earth, but that could happen at some later flyby. International cooperation is critical because asteroids are something that affect the entire planet. It takes the whole world to bring to bear capabilities to find asteroids, determine their orbits, and asteroid impacts could affect anywhere on Earth. And so it is really important that it is a worldwide collaboration because it is a worldwide issue.